99% of bananas exported to developed countries are just one group, called the Cavendish. And the Cavendish is vulnerable to Tropical Race 4, a fungus that's now ravaging banana farms across the globe. Back in 2019, Dr. James Dale announced that his team had successfully injected the DNA from a resistant banana into a Cavendish. And it worked. But no one would buy his miracle banana because it was genetically modified. In the EU, most member countries have either partly or fully banned GMOs. In the US, they're allowed, but feared. One argument against GMOs is that these modified plants would quickly spread their genes and kill out biodiversity. But with bananas, that's not a problem. The genes don't move because they are sterile. You can grow a GM banana next to a non-GM banana for 50 years and the gene will not move from one to the other. Incredibly frustrating. There's a solution, but it's, it's a scientific solution, but not a political solution.